Hello everyone, Nathan here. My picture right here even. Second post currently when you search for my test. That's pretty cool. But that is totally off topic. Today we are looking at how to install sub games on Linux. So first off, we of course are going to want to download some sub games. So let's go to mytest.net. And then we will click on the customize button and we'll click sub games, which will pull us up to this little page here where it shows us a list of sub games and it gives us a few popular ones listed right here with direct download links well actually it goes to the forums why is it links to the form um, I'll just go ahead and click on the tutorial button because I don't believe I have that sub game installed um okay so we'll scroll through here and I guess the download link's not actually even included there. We will take this. And... Mm, you know, I'm going to live on the edge and I'm going to take the developer version. So we'll just download this. We're going to go ahead and save it. 817 kilobytes. That's pretty small. And then we will open our downloads. And we should have in here someplace a zip folder. Which, yeah, I don't see, actually. Tutorial. And downloads, downloads. Yeah, I'm just blind. Okay. So we have our zip folder here. We're going to go ahead and open that with our... Um, our whatchamacallit. Uh, archive manager. And then we're going to go to our home folder. And now, by default, when you first install a Linux distro, you're not going to have your hidden files showing your directory that you're going to be installing the you know, sub games or textures or anything to for my test will be in a hidden directory so we are going to go to view show hidden files otherwise we can use the keyboard shortcut control h which will open up and then we want to do dot mine test is going to be our directory and we are going to go to what are we going to go to we are going to go into games and then we are going to go ahead and just drag tutorial right from there. And you know what? I actually have tutorial, so let me delete that. We'll just delete that, and then we'll extract the file. We now have tutorial here. Then we will just launch mine test. Go to single player, and we'll see we have all of our sub games here listed on the bottom now. With a fresh installation, you're only going to have... A mind test game I think minimal development test still comes that'll be it so the rest of these icons are all sub games I have installed we just installed a tutorial here um, we are going to we're going to restore tutorial tab to single player which is where we're at we're going to hit new we will enter a world name of tutorial we will create, we will play, and we will see what happens. Welcome tutorial. Woohoo. Okay. So these are important key bindings. This is on a little sign there. We've got some little mats on the floor, I guess. We've got another sign here. It's a game engine, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so you need these things to play called mods. Just some little decoration up here. Pretty cool so far. So we're kind of just going through a building. Ooh, we're in the open air. I'm in a jumping section. Small abyss. I can even walk over it. What? So I can. I should jump over that one, though. Cool. Okay, what's this one say? There'll be branching paths. There's information on arrow signs. Which, uh, it just says ladders. Alright, let's go use some ladders. So you see that, and I actually have not played this up game before. This is actually pretty cool. Um, yeah. So you will see that installing a sub game is as simple as that. Oh, and we jump into a pool of water. And there is, uh, there's a lump of gold in here. I've collected my first, there's 13 gold ingots throughout the tutorial. Wow, this is really cool. Um, but this is not a video about the sub game, so uh, let me stop playing the sub game. 
and we will just close out of that. So that is how you install sub games in my test. Now you will have a game directory here already existing. Um, it'll only have, you know, I take that back. You may not have that folder existing. If you don't, you just want to go ahead and create a new folder and call it games. Um, because the default game and the minimal development test are actually stored in your user share folder. So there you go, guys. How to install a sub game on Linux for my test. Hope this helped somebody. Check back again soon for new videos. And thanks for watching.